to my channel so for today's video i'm gonna be doing the meaning behind my tattoo honey yes and also i'm gonna be letting you guys know which tattoo hurt the worst when i got them done so at the end of this video if you guys like this video make sure you guys like comment subscribe make sure you guys hit that bell so you guys can be notified whenever i post let's get straight into the video so the first tattoo that i have well the first tattoo I, well i'm not even gonna be doing first second third but i got this tattoo done when I was 18 years old, it's a dove with my mom's name. A dove symbolizes motherhood. And my mom's name is Debbie. And it's like close. Like, you know, when you say dove and Debbie, it's kind of, you know, close. It comes close. So, um, she's a mom to seven children. You know what that means, huh? <laughs> Bump. And I was kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, she's a mom to seven children um without her i would not be here and i also got it because it can mean peace and remembrance and everything like that like i got it so i can remember her while she's here on earth or if she passes god forbid but i mean everybody everybody has to go one day no offense but i'm just saying it's the truth so that's the reason why i got that uh the tattoo of the dove and her name next tattoo i got um I got a tattoo on my stomach. I'm not going to lift up my shirt because I was just doing too much. But I'm going to insert a picture of what it looks like. It's a butterfly with um, each of my sister's middle names. Um, I have three other sisters. I'm the oldest girl, though. <laughs> whoop, whoop. <laughs> um, basically, the reason why I got the butterfly because it reminds me of growth. And all my sisters are unique in their own individual way. And they're growing up to be great young women. And I'm very proud of them. And that's the reason why I got this tattoo. Because, you know, they're some strong African-American women. And I'm just proud of them at the end of the day. They all doing their own thing in a positive way. They're not into any type of bad activities or anything like that. So, you know, for... I'm just proud to call them my sisters at the end of the day. So... That's the reason why I got that, that, that tattoo done. Um, Next tattoo I got done is the Gemini. I can show y'all that since it's on my arm. Gemini symbol. The reason why I got a Gemini symbol, of course, is because I'm a Gemini. <laughs> Shout out to all the Geminis out there. But I'm cray cray. So I've been told. <laughs> I don't even care because at the end of the day, I don't care. I like who I am. I like my personality. Shoot either you can handle me or you can't it really don't matter it's like a billion trillion people on earth that can possibly handle me if you can't oh well too bad so sad but <laughs> i like who i am as a person and i mean to be honest with you sometimes i really do be having to come to meeting with myself and i just be like dang girl you is really acting out today what is going on so in order for me to even be talking to myself like that i already know something's going on in the brain and you know at least i'm accepting it that's the thing <laughs> some people will do some crazy stuff and don't even accept it so at least i'm like okay yeah i'm crazy and <laughs> do you like me or nah not no, just kidding <laughs> so yeah i'm a gemini and i love to be a gemini and i mean it's pretty cool it's pretty fun to learn who you are and yourself and everything like that and yeah okay next tattoo i'm gonna show y'all um the Jesus hands and then Philippians 413 um the reason I got Philippians 413 because um and the God hands is because there's a lot of stuff that has happened to me in life that I honestly thank God for because I'm like without you and without you like uh, making me strong in certain situations I would not have I would have literally had given up like for once I was in a domestic violence relationship yeah the dude was putting his hands on me everything like that and for one split second I thought that I was defeated like I was literally like 
depressed like i was laying down on the couch just depressed sometimes certain days i was eating i was blaming myself like bro like why did he do that to me like you know um i never thought i was gonna get over it that's the thing i never thought i was gonna get over it and i was just like man like i kept praying to god like i was just like look i can't handle it by myself i need your help i need strength I'm not trying to get all sentiments. I need strength because I remember the day like it happened yesterday. I was like, I need strength. I need you to come in my life and make basically, you know, help me grow and help me move forward. So basically, um, he helped me and I moved on and I'm good now. So yeah, <laughs> that's the reason why I got Philippians 4.13 in the God hands. Because without God, I wasn't going to be able to even move forward from that situation. So yeah, I thank him every day for that. And that's what comes next. The strength. Strength tattoo. I don't know if you guys can see. Strength tattoo. Uh, I got the strength tattoo because another situation that has happened to me. Sorry that you got my hands are in the way. But another situation that happened to me was um, I was homeless for about four to five months. Um excuse me i was homeless for four to five months due to a family situation i'm not gonna explain what happened but i was living in my vehicle technically outside basically uh where i would park at i will park like inside of like a walmart where there's a lot of patrolling going on or a lot of security going on just so nothing bad will happen to me or anything like that or sometimes i would have to park in the neighborhood where I just didn't know what was going to happen to me. But at the end of the day, I was not scared. Like, I felt God's hands wrapped around me in my car. Which was, like, I was not scared. I don't know. It's just, I, I felt him there. Like, I felt him there. Like, I knew he was there or one of his angels was there. Or a couple of his angels was there. But I was just not scared. Or at all. Like, because anything could happen to you when you um outside sleeping outside in the car like somebody could break in your window i mean your car somebody could do anything to you and my car was not tinted which means when the sun rises and it's bright outside you can see me or even when it's dark you can still see me because the windows are not tinted so i got strength because uh for me to be able to move forward like i've just been through a lot of stuff like if i sit here and do a story time of everything that i've been through y'all gonna be like dang girl but i just been through a lot of stuff and you know i tattoo i tattoo my struggles and what i've been through on me to like let you guys or let me myself remember what i've been through and i came out of it and it made me stronger at the end of the day so yeah i never forget what has happened to me and everything like that so um yeah the last tattoo that i got well, not the last tattoo because I forgot my skull tattoo on my ankle. But the next tattoo that I got is a rose. <laughs> the reason why I got a rose is because <laughs> I honestly love, love roses. Like, it, it, it reminds me of growth. Is this train really doing this right now? Hold on. The train is passing by, y'all. I My apologies. Anyways... As I was saying, the reason I got the rose tattoo because it reminds me of growth and it reminds me of life. Basically, it's gonna be a weird story, but like, you know how back in the like when I was younger, I always wanted a rose tattoo because when I was younger, like, you know, those little love movies and everything like that. And you know how when a dude loves, like, when a guy likes a girl, he'll bring her like a flower, which would normally be a rose. So I'm like, ooh, that looks nice or whatever. I was all into those love movies and everything like that. Also, it's because i'm talking real fast right now i'm sorry because my braces are hurting and i'm like if i talk any slower the pain's gonna hurt worse so i'm just like come on jesus also um i got a rose because i don't know i just love roses at the end of the day i just you know i just love roses it reminds me of life and growth and everything like that the last tattoo i have let me see if i can show y'all I don't want to be bending all down and struggling. That's the reason why I didn't show you the tattoo on my um, stomach. Because, like, look. Look how difficult this is going to be. Okay. I'm ashy. School tattoo. Well, I don't know if that was difficult, but I feel like it was. But anyways, 
I got a skull tattoo because your girl, I'm a tomboy. Well, I'm kind of sort of transforming into a girly girl in a way. But I'm not going to transform completely into a nigga put a ring on his finger, okay? But anyways, I got a skull tattoo. <laughs> I got a skull tattoo because I'm, I was into, I don't know if you guys know, but Ed Hardy. Ed Hardy reminds me of tattoos. Like a lot of tattoos or a lot of sick not sick as in sick, but sick as in eh, sick, like, eh, like, <laughs> sick as in, but, um, yeah, I was into that type of stuff. I wanted a skull tattoo, and also, um, Harley Davis, I believe, if my lips is ashy, it's because I ain't got no Carmex on, don't be talking about me, it don't matter, everybody has some days where they lips is dry, today might just be my day, don't be talking about me, though, but anyway, <laughs> I got, um, um ed hardy ed hardy and harley davis i don't know if harley davis is a motorcycle situation that's what i'm talking about um basically i always wanted a motorcycle since i've been 16 years old but obviously i grew out of that because i don't know why i just wanted i just wanted a car basically at the end of the day i really didn't care so yeah that's the reason why i got the school tattoo also i was young so it was like nobody was gonna tell me nothing once i hit 18 i was getting that tattoo i don't care so out of all my tattoos i feel like the tattoo that hurt the worst was the tattoo on my stomach because he had to do it over he had to do it twice and i'm not talking about the lining because first when people do the tattoo they do the outside lining and then they start adding in the shades or whatever whatever part that want y'all want or you want to get shaded that the tattoo artist will shade it in or whatever no this dude literally got done with my whole tattoo and did it over again everybody knows once you get once the needle hits your skin and starts actually you know doing what it do it starts to burn it starts to hurt so for him to have to do it twice i'm just like oh my gosh i felt like i was gonna die literally i felt like i was gonna, I was gonna die because it was already open wound like it was already open wound <laughs> it was already open skin but he already broke it open basically broke it open i'm just thinking maybe it's just my own thoughts the way i'm thinking <laughs> <Woo -hoo -wee! laughs> Ooh, i don't know what's going on today y'all but anyways so he literally it hurt worse because he had to redo it basically so that's the tattoo out of all my tattoos my stomach was a tattoo that hurt the worst because he had to do it twice so yeah <laughs> everything else was cool it was fandy dandy because i got let me see i got these tattoos done at the same time string tattoo and the rose tattoo and then after that i got the gemini symbol philippians 413 and the god hands done in one day so i got the string tattoo and the rose tattoo done in one day then like next week or the week after i got the three other tattoos done so you know it's not it's not gonna be the one that hurt the worst is what i'm saying so yeah i think i stumped up all my tattoos ah, tell me how i did your girl did good then she i know i know give me my dad so i got told you yeah so if you guys like to say yeah Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you guys hit that bell, like I said, so you guys can be notified whenever I post. And stay tuned for the next video. Bye, guys.